Hey there, this is Stacy. I hope everyone's having a great day. I'm here to do a video that I was tagged in by both Natalie075 and um, the hip chick online, Kim. So thanks for tagging me, my friends. And this is kind of a fun video. It's called, like, beauty things that I suck at. And um, first off, I have to say that I didn't ever say the word suck until my mother got cancer. And the only thing, when you know someone that has cancer, the only thing you can say about cancer is that it sucks. I mean, literally and truly, everything about it does. Um, so it's just kind of funny because until probably three years ago, that word was not even in my vocabulary. And now, um, I really just say it when I'm talking about cancer, but um, I thought I'd go ahead and do this video because it's really kind of funny. It was really funny for me watching these friends of mine saying it because it's just such a weird word to me. I remember like growing up and my brother saying it and I would think, oh my gosh, you know, he just cursed um, by saying that word. So anyway, I have my things uh, written down here on my little clipboard. So I will get started. So the first thing that I say that I suck at is not buying new things. And, um, and I am a sucker for beauty products. I just cannot help it. Um, I don't know what it is. Obviously, it's an obsession. And I'm just forever buying new things, whether I need them or not. I just always give in. I say I'm not going to buy, I'm not going to buy, and then I go to the store. Or, I mean, I even purposely go to the store to buy things just because, I don't know, you just kind of feel better sometimes when you get a new lipstick or whatever. Um, my second thing that I suck at is winged liner, and you guys know I've been struggling to figure out how to do a pretty winged liner on my eyes for uh, probably a couple years now, and um, I just suck at it. I'm, I'm just not good at it, and sometimes I'll do it. I don't do it that often. I think that younger people don't realize that um, us middle-aged women have um, just kind of like crepier eyelids, and so the liner doesn't go on as smoothly and evenly and all as we all want and y'all just show us how to do it and you're like it's so easy just keep practicing well I can't help it um, I'm just not good at it it's just my wrinkly old eyelids that are uh, contributing to the problem now uh, the next thing is my hair I suck at anything that has to do with my hair uh, I think part of it is because I'm impatient and I don't like to take the time to do things so uh, here you have hair of the day is, um, you guys know I finally got my, oh, figures the doorbell rings and there goes the dog barking. Um, anyway, I got the bangs cut here a couple weeks ago and I'm really liking them because when I pull my hair back, now I still have a little something on my face that kind of frames it a little bit. So I do like that, but I'm just kind of in a bun today. I just got back um, recently from walking and from a visit to Ulta to pick up something that I saw on HSN that I had to have. Um, the next thing is jumping out of my comfort zone. I suck at that. I obviously wear neutral sh um, eyeshadows and makeup all the time. And um, I just suck at, you know, I would never wear blue or, or green or something like that. And I really should because you see a lot of brown-eyed girls wearing that kind of stuff. And I just suck at it. I'm very comfortable with neutrals and so I don't ever get out of my comfort zone. Um, and I'm sure I suck at a ton more things, but this is the last one that I have on my list for today. Um, and it's that I suck at remembering my brows and like correctors and concealers and stuff like that. I just didn't grow up, um, you know, filling in my brows and I didn't grow up uh, using like concealers and correctors and those kinds of products. So I suck at remembering to use them. And I, I'd have to say, you know, if I use them once a week, uh, well, the brows anyway, I, I might use correctors and concealers a little more often, but I walk so much that a lot of times I put my makeup on for the day, um, you know, I'll just spend a little bit in the morning and, um, you know, with some correctors and concealers sometimes, but not always because I'm just wearing a lot of times just like a tinted moisturizer to, um, you know, with a sunscreen during the day to get me through my walk and so I'm not getting burnt while I'm out there. So, oh, and I do have one more, one more thing with my neutral eyes I forgot to mention was pink lips. Um, my comfort zone of pink lipsticks. Milky pink lipsticks, even bright pink lipsticks, I don't really jump out of the comfort zone of pinks. 
and um, I actually put on a lip gloss to film this and it was red when it was in the little thing and I thought oh hey I jumped out of my comfort zone I was going to show you guys and then it kind of looks more clear while it's on my lip so that didn't really work so well so anyway I tag anyone to do this video that hasn't done it yet I know a lot of my friends here have done it already so uh, do this video when you get a chance and tell us what you suck at and um, upload it and uh, leave it as a video response I'd love to see it because I think it's fun and funny to see people saying that word like I said so anyway I hope everyone's having a great day thanks so much for watching and I will see you all again soon bye